Hey everybody, this is Ben from Appliance Factory and Mattress Kingdom, and today we're talking about the differences in LG's dishwasher line. If you're looking to find out the differences between things like True Steam and Direct Drive, you're in the right place. Also, a reminder, whenever we do these videos, we're not gonna go over specific pricing because that is subject to change based on the manufacturer. This is an overview to help you decide which features are right for you. So, let's get into it. All right, so we're gonna start with the entry-level dishwasher in LG's line. This is the LDF N45 42S, and this replaces the LDF 5545SS. This unit runs at 48 decibels, which is very quiet for an entry-level dishwasher. So you have your standard cycles that you see on most dishwashers. What's really interesting though is LG has their ThinkQ app, which allows you to actually download a cycle. They have actually a lot of different cycles on the app that you can choose to download, and it replaces the download cycle button with that cycle. Really cool, gives you a little bit of customization option. Another option you have here is your dual zone. So that does allow you to set certain areas of the washer to actually get more cleaning, which is really cool if you have one area where you wanna put your really heavily caked stuff. You also do have a half load that goes up or down, so you can load either just the top or the bottom rack, which is gonna help you save water if you wanna run a smaller load. You do also have high temperature wash, which is really cool because this is NSF, which is National Sanitation Foundation certified for their sanitizing, really cool there. Does also have an extra dry cycle, which takes advantage of their dynamic dry system, which is actually a combination of a heater and a blower to make sure that everything gets really clean or really dry. Let's take a look inside it. So one of the first things you're going to notice looking inside of this dishwasher is that this is actually a full stainless tub. And that's not something that you see very often in an entry level dishwasher. So I know we said we weren't going to go over specific pricing, but something to be aware of is that the entry level dishwasher from LG runs comparably to mid range dishwashers from other lines. But then at the top end, they're very comparable again. So just keep that in mind. If you do want to get an entry level LG, it is going to run closer to the mid range of other brands because instead of a plastic tub, like most entry level dishwashers, this is full stainless and it helps it more quiet and more durable. It doesn't hold smells or crack like plastic tubs can. What you're gonna notice next is we've got this third rack so you can put your silverware up here. Really nice option there if you do wanna remove your silverware rack from the bottom and have more space on the bottom for large items. You do also have a second rack here which is adjustable for height using these. So if you have tall, awkward items you wanna put on the bottom, you can raise or lower the second rack. And then on the inside here, one of the really cool things about LG is they have a quad wash with direct drive. So that's their wash arm in here. You'll notice that this one actually has four wash arms instead of two like most dishwashers do. And you'll notice that these silver parts actually oscillate back and forth. So as it spins, it washes both sides of your dishes, which is really cool. It also has a direct drive motor, which is basically a gear system as opposed to a belt or a water pressure system. So it's quieter and it tends to be a little bit more reliable, less moving parts. And that is the entry level option from LG. Let's take a look at the next one. All right, this is the mid-range option from LG. This is the LDP 68. 10SS and it's replacing the LDP 6809SS and the LDP 6797ST. Basically they took two of their mid-range options, combined them into one to make sure you get the most bang for your buck and get as many features as possible. This one does run at 44 decibels, which is significantly quieter than the previous model, which at 48 decibels that's already really quiet for an entry-level dishwasher. This has very similar features, but what you'll notice before we look at that is that it's still a pocket handle, but the controls are actually on the top and not the front on this model. And this one does come in stainless and black stainless. You'll notice it has the same standard cycles, but has your dual zone half load if you wanna save that water. The big thing you're gonna notice that's different on this one is going to be the steam function. And that is, you'll see this is again, full stainless interior, helps with that quietness and that durability. And then it does have these true steam jets, which it actually starts the cycle with a blast of steam to help loosen any caked on foods or residual things. So you don't have to pre-wash your dishes, which is really nice. But then at the end of the cycle, it also hits another blast of steam, which is going to help to reduce water spots. So really nice option there if you're tired of wash, wiping your stuff out with a towel when you're done with the load does have a third rack option up here. You'll notice this dark gray portion actually is adjustable so you can up and down the height. So any awkward items like ladles, mixing spoons, things like that, they fit in that top rack a little bit more nicely. 
Another cool upgrade here is going to be that these are actually on glide racks. So there's ball bearings in the upper rack on this one that helps it glide really nicely. A little bit of adjustability in the tines and does have a really nice wine glass holder there over on the side. Again, adjustable for height too on this upper rack so that if you do have something awkward in the lower rack, you can move this higher or lower to help it fit. And then in the bottom, you notice again, tines are adjustable but this one does also have the quad wash pretty standard on most of the LG models with that direct drive motor to help with durability, quietness, and then again, they oscillate so you hit both sides of the dishes. Very cool there, but really your big upgrades over the previous version are going to be the adjustable third rack, the glide rails, the steam functions, and then of course this one is 44 decibels, which is significantly quieter. Let's go take a look at the upper end model. This is the LSD TS988US. And this is replacing the LSD T9908SS. First thing you're gonna notice about this model is this one actually comes with a towel bar. So different from the pocket handle you see on the other options, this also does only come in stainless steel. So if you want a different color, you might be limited to some of the different options from LG. You'll notice this does actually have top controls as well. So same standard cycles. And again, has that extra dry half load, all the stuff that you're used to seeing from the other options. Now this one actually runs at 40 decibels. So that is incredibly quiet for a dishwasher. Uh, if you don't know how decibels work, they work on a logarithmic scale. So without getting into the science of it, small changes in decibel level mean big changes in noise level. So 40 decibels, is basically whisper quiet. You have a really hard time hearing that this thing is running. They start to actually put lights on them at this level so you can see that they're running. Now you notice this one does have a third rack. It does again have the adjustable upper rack with glide rails. And this is actually um, not the correct model. We haven't floored the new one yet. So this one does do have the true steam option as well and the glide racks on the top and then in your upper level model, you're also still gonna have that quad wash with the oscillating sprayers. And what's a different thing about this one, somewhere where you're gonna get that upgrade, is there's actually lights on the inside of the tubs in the upper level models. So that way, depending on your lighting situation, if you have your dishwasher put somewhere where it's a little bit harder to see, there are actually lights on the inside of this unit. And then it does also have the option to do a smart diagnostic with the app. So if there is an issue maintenance wise, you can actually sometimes get the diagnostics from the machine itself and send it to LG. So when they send their repair technician out, they save you some time by having the parts already. It doesn't have to be two trips. It can sometimes be one trip, which is really nice because everybody's so busy right now. So again, with this one, the big upgrades you're gonna be seeing because it does still have the steam options, has the quad wash, has the glide racks, all the things that you're used to seeing from the previous models. Where you get your upgrades here is that this one is insanely quiet, 40 decibels, and then it does also have the lights on the inside. That's the end of our overview of the LG dishwasher line. If we miss anything, or if there's anything you have other questions about, please leave us a comment. We like to hear from you. It gives us ideas for future videos, and we want to make sure that we've given you all of the information that you need to make an informed buying decision. Uh, if this was helpful for you, please leave us a like. It really helps us out. And subscribe to the channel. Turn on your notifications too, so you don't miss any of our content. We drop all the time from different people about different topics, and we don't want you to miss anything. So again, thanks for watching, and until next time, keep it clean, everybody.